Well, Chris in Madison, a witness, described what he said. He saw a plane literally falling out of the sky until it crashed into a fiery mess in front of this Wilden family's home. You can see what is left over tonight of that plane crash, which is really just rubble and damaged trees in the front yard and damaged brush from that fire that happened. Uh, we are told that all four people amazingly on board survived that crash thanks to the help from a good Samaritan. Everybody cut out. This startling video shows the moments after the plane crashed into a fiery, mangled mess. Driving nearby was Steve Scharf, who says he watched the plane take off from a private airport nearby. It was kind of crazy when I turned the corner. I saw the airplane and heard a big boom as if like the engine stalled out. And then it pretty much did like a 180 turn and dive down and crashed right here. Scharf says he jumped into action, grabbing his fire extinguisher and racing to help all four passengers off the plane. Pretty bad burns on their hands and faces. All of their hair was pretty much burned up. Uh, but the guy that was flying, the gentleman, he actually had a pretty bad broken leg. Two men, a pregnant woman and a boy under 18 years of age, were on board, according to officials. Scharf says he helped pull the survivors to safety, who later told him they were family. Officials say, incredibly, all four passengers survived, but remain in critical condition at a local hospital tonight. Luckily for the residents, the aircraft did not hit the house. There was no damage to the property, and no bystanders were hurt. Now back out here live in Wilden, a friend of the family tells us they are all recovering tonight at the UC Davis Medical Center. We have no word on what caused this crash, but fire officials tell us officials with the uh, NTSB as well as the FAA have been alerted and they'll be picking up the investigation.